guys welcome back to my channel if you're new hi welcome to my channel my name is cambria i am a teen mom to my one-year-old daughter everly and i have a boyfriend named dalton and today i am going to be doing a little q a i asked you guys on instagram and snapchat to ask me some questions so i'm just gonna be answering the ones that you guys asked i think there's around like 15 or 16 questions not quite sure so yes also if the lighting changes i'm using natural lighting so i'm really sorry about that so the first question is are you going to college no i am not going to go to college um i had maybe thought that i was going to go to cosmetology school when i really was around like a month old like almost two months i think and then i don't know i just i enjoy being a stay-at-home mom a lot and i thought about being an oncologist which is a cancer doctor which is another thing that i really I'm passionate about I'm very content at where I am in my life like I absolutely love being a stay-at-home mom like I was literally just talking to my best friend autumn about this last night like I'm literally so content in my life like I've never been happier I have a great relationship with Dalton I have a great relationship with my daughter I love what I do I love doing YouTube and staying home and taking care of a house and taking well, not like fully taking care of a house because this is my mom's house but you get the point um, and taking care of everything like I love it I, I like I'm so content I feel like just as our little family like we're so content where we are I mean of course a little bit more money would be nice and when we move out it will be even better but yeah I'm very content so no I don't think I'll ever go to college um I don't know there's just nothing that I'm truly passionate about that requires me to go to college if one day I find that I do want to or I don't know I just feel like I need to for some reason then obviously I will but right now we're really content where we are so no I don't think I'll be going to college how many kids do you want uh, I don't really know I've been asked this question before or Dalton has been asked this question before when we did when he did a Q&A but I don't know I've always thought that I'm not a big fan of like odd numbers so I've always thought that I wanted four kids just because it's a good even number like two and two like you know two will play to play with each other the other two will play with each other nobody will be left out I don't know I could see us having three kids or four no more than four I know I could not handle more than four I don't even know if I could handle four because Everly like right now is plenty so I don't know between two and four or two and three I don't know we'll see where do you see you and your family in five years? This is a really good question. I love this question. But we will be 23. Um, that's wild. Yeah, we'll be 23. That's crazy that I'm going to be 23 in only five years. Like, it, oh my god, that's so weird. So yeah, we'll be 23. So I see my family. I think we realistically want to be done having kids by the time we're 24 or 25 and 26 at the absolute latest because we still want to have a life like once our kids like move out of the house and stuff like that like we can just do things ourselves still not be like super old if that makes sense so we'll definitely either be having our last kid or be working on it obviously be married I want to be married like very soon or within the next couple of years because it's just something that's important to me and I know it's important to Dalton too hopefully well we will own a house I mean I would hope um, and then probably I see Dalton either working on starting a construction business or maybe have starting it. I don't know. Five years might be pushing it to start a business, but whatever's handed to him, I guess we'll see what happens. If you don't know what Dalton wants to do, he, his like absolute dream is to have a construction business of his own and to build houses and all that kind of stuff. So yeah. And I see myself um, being further on YouTube, hopefully if YouTube's still around, maybe making a living off of that. And also, if you don't know one of the reasons also why I'm not going to college, which you can call me stupid if you want or tell me it's not a, not a good idea. I'm letting Dalton kind of live his dream if that makes sense. And it might sound bad in a way, but I don't really care because it's what works for our relationship. Dalton wants to own a construction business and I want to be there to help him with like paperwork and bills and stuff like that and all the sides of the business that he's not going to want to deal with. He's going to want to do the hands-on stuff and not the office work where I would be doing that and I would be helping him with that. That's literally something we've talked about since we were like 15 years old and we're 18 now. Um, so yeah, I could see myself still doing YouTube hopefully and then also helping Dalton alongside with the business. I just, we're just so 
happy together so I hope we're just still as happy. Dream is to build a really nice home one day and just customize it how we want and I, Dalton definitely would love to be able to say that he built his own house so yeah either in the process of building a house or have built a house hopefully be done having kids hopefully Dalton has his own business hopefully I'm further on YouTube and I'm helping him with the business that's really that if all those things could happen then I'd be like good with my life I'd be like I made it I'm good so yeah that's where I want to be in five years but who knows where we're actually gonna be the next question is how did you decide what to name Everly is there a backstory so I am really into 50s music I have been since I was a little girl and if you guys know who the Everly Brothers are they were a band back then so that's kind of where I don't want to say that's where it started but it's definitely somewhere where I have heard the name but originally where I got it from was if you guys know who Channing Tatum is um, his daughter's name is Everly and when I heard that I literally fell in love um, so yeah from Channing Tatum that's where I got Everly's name from and then also the Everly Brothers they have really awesome music and I don't know I'm just obsessed with her name I think it's so beautiful and then her middle name is Diana and um, somebody that helped raise me if you guys watched my video called my best friend died of cancer that video is about this lady but she raised me she was my nanny her name was Diane and I she passed away from cancer and I wanted to contribute her in some sort of way since she's not here to see my daughter grow up I wanted to name one of my kids after her and my first kid happened to be a girl so instead of Diane I did Diana because I think it just flows better with Everly's name I think Everly Diana sounds better than Everly Diane so yeah that is where I got that from and then I've also I also loved Princess Diana so it's kind of just like it all just worked out perfectly so yeah that's where I got Everly's name from it was pretty simple and I'm just, I love her name, like, still to this day, I'm obsessed with it. <laughs> uh, somebody asked, can you make another baby? Desiree Dalton's cousin asked that question. The answer to that is, yes, we can make another baby, but not anytime soon. At least I hope not. Uh, probably within, like, the next year and a half to two years. I think realistically, because we, we don't want our kids to be super far apart in age, so I think around when Everly's like one and a half, two years, we probably consider it, so got a little bit to wait. The next question is when do you plan on moving out? So we, in a perfect world, when you don't realize how expensive everything is, before you get into the real world is what I'm trying to say, before you realize how expensive things are and everything like that, we thought that we would move out by the time that Everly was one. But little did we know how expensive everything actually is and when you add it up and having a kid and just having money for other things that come up that you're not expecting. Yeah, we thought we'd be moved out by the time that Everly was one. That obviously didn't happen, but now that Dalton is in school, pretty sure he graduates in May. Um, and then we'll have like a full-time job and he's getting paid like obviously like a real amount of money, like a good amount. We'll be moved out hopefully in June because he graduates in May, depending on how quickly he gets a job and gets started, it would either be in like the late days of May or like the early days of June. So I'm really, really excited to move out and have my own place and to take care of it and everything like that. Like, I don't know, it sounds stupid, but I'm so excited to just be like with my little family. My sister asked, what is love? I don't know how to answer that. What is love? Love is what makes your soul happy. I don't know, just like what you find joy in doing. Whatever you find joy in doing, that's love. But if you mean like a person, like a relationship, I don't know, who, who you want to spend your days with, your best friend, who you want to do everything with, who you never get sick of no matter how much time you're around them. Um, when you get butterflies in your stomach, that's love. You just, you got each other's back through everything. That's love. That's my definition of love anyway. But what really is love? I don't know. Does anybody really know? The next question is, do you plan to travel with Everly when she gets older? Yes. I love going on trips, like, so much. I, my parents, like, used to take us on little trips here and there. Like, I've been to Mexico, Disney World... Nashville just different little other states and like yeah but definitely for sure Dalton's never been on an airplane so he is getting his butt on an airplane and he's gonna experience it and we're gonna go to some cool places I definitely want to go back to Nashville which we wouldn't take a plane there we would 
road trip it because it's about 15 hours but that's what my family did and it was so fun um so yeah we definitely want to do some road trips we have a few other places we want to go we love doing road trips and just like camping and stuff like that we want to go to the Grand Canyon one day Dalton really wants to go there he also really wants to go to Canada and I want to go there too we want to go to Canada I would love to go to Paris one day just travel Europe honestly so yeah definitely traveling Jordan one of my BFFs asked will you ever adopt me I mean maybe you kind of eat a lot and you kind of cost a lot of money so maybe I mean we basically already are your parents so maybe we'll adopt you one day I mean we basically have already the next question is I've been thinking of joining it works and I was wondering how it's going personally for you and if it's worth it so if you don't know I worked for a company called it works which is where you sell health and wellness products off of your phone um, so you can do it all from um, your home or wherever you want and I do not actually work for it works anymore I quit I think about a month and a half maybe two months ago it wasn't like super long ago and I loved the company so much I absolutely loved the girls that I was surrounded with like the support and love and like I don't know just lifting each other up is crazy like amazing in that company and I loved the company and what I did and everything but I just I couldn't do it anymore because Everly got to be a handful she is a handful so I recommend trying it though like it's great especially when you're in college because you can do it from anywhere you can message people and sell things when you're walking to class when you're sitting in your dorm like just like I think it's really good so I would recommend trying it like I loved it um but I just it wasn't for me anymore if that makes sense because I couldn't be on I couldn't pay as much attention to my phone as I wanted to if that makes sense but I loved the company and I loved working for them how long do you plan on doing YouTube slash what made you start well how long I plan on doing YouTube is for a long time as long as my kids are okay with it and okay with me recording them like when they're older obviously like right now she doesn't realize that I'm recording her but um yeah as long as they're okay with it then I'm good with it and as long as I keep like getting views obviously not everything is about the views as long as i'm getting views though and if i am making a living from it that would be great but i plan on doing it as long as my kids allow me to and as long as they're okay with being filmed when, what made you start i just saw a lot of other moms doing it i just thought it looked fun and once i became a stay-at-home mom i wanted something to like keep like like, I wanted a hobby, if that makes sense, to, like, do during the day and not just do, like, cleaning and watching a kid. So, yeah, that's what made me start, and I'm so glad that I started. It's, like, one of the best decisions I've ever made. What are some baby names you might use in the future? I was literally just talking to my friend Catherine about this yesterday, but Dalton is obsessed with the name Hazel, so if we have another girl, her name will... I love the name Hazel, but I'm very big on nicknames, so... I can't really make a nickname out of Hazel if that makes sense but I did see the name Hazley and I think that's a beautiful name and it would go really good with Everly, Everly and Hazley. I think that's so cute. Dalton loves it and we could call her Hazel for short. Um, so yeah I'm obsessed with the name Hazley so that would definitely be our next daughter's name. Um, and then I also love the name Navy for a girl. It's very different. I know it's like a color or whatever but Catherine's obsessed with this name when I said that she was like oh my god you have to use this I don't know I think all of our kids names should like end in a y or something because I don't know it's just really cute I think the name navy is really cute so yeah I love Hazley for sure and then possibly navy then for a boy we struggle really hard on boy names Dalton's obsessed with the name Beckett that would have been Everly's name if she was a boy so yeah maybe Beckett I love the name Bo for a boy I love the name Leo but I don't know if I'll ever use that probably back it but we'll see i also am obsessed with the name wilder but i don't know i don't think that dalton like that there's another girl on youtube who has a son named wilder so i don't want her to like think that i copied her or something um and i also know a girl like around my town who has a son named wilder so again like i don't want to think that i don't want them to think like i'm copying them but i love that name a lot but that's all the questions you guys actually left some pretty good questions hopefully this video wasn't too long but yeah, that's it. Don't forget to like and subscribe. All my social medias are always in the description bar below. So don't forget to follow me and all of those. And yeah, I will see you guys next time. Bye, guys.